Hi there guys, welcome back to Anything Blows. My name is Andrew Dika and on today's video, I've got a prediction video for you. Um, th this week's fight, April 22nd, by the way, just before I get into this, what a week it is, April 22nd, not just for boxing, but for combat sports. We've got several title fights, such as the Bridgeweight title fight, WBC. We've got the UFC going on. We've got influencer boxing. And, and tonight, Friday, you've got um, Return of Misfits. So boxing and combat sports all round is huge this week. And obviously Ryan Garcia um, and Javante Davis. So back onto this video. Um, I've got a prediction video today for you guys and I'm going to be giving you my predictions for this Saturday's fight, April 22nd at the Cardiff International Centre in Cardiff, Wales. Shavkat Ra Ra Rakimov versus Joe Cordina for the IBF featherweight world title. Um, Joe Cordina was the former champ and he's fighting in his hometown. And th this is his chance to become two-time IBF world champion. And he joins the list of fighters such as Tyson Fury to regain and re-win a belt for the second time. To become two-time champion without losing for the first time. Joe Cordina is fighting in his hometown out of Cardiff. He, he fights out of Cardiff, Wales. Um, Shavkat um, fights out of Tajikistan. And um, let, let's get into the fighters. Joe Cordina's record is 15 and 0. He has nine KOs. Um, he won the belt against um, Kenichi Ogawa in a second round KO last year, which was superb. And um, unfortunate the way things have gone, being sh stripped of the belt and having the belt taken away of, taken off of him, and he has to vacate it. Um, Shavkat Rakimov was a former IBO. Um, IBF, sorry, um, no, I, IBO, um, super featherweight um, champion. He defended that on several occasions. Um, Shavkat is Shavkat won the IBF featherweight title last year in Abu Dhabi um, uh, in the ninth round TKO. Um, he's defending his belt for the first time. Joe Cordina looking to regain and re-win a belt that he never truly lost in his hometown, in his home city of Cardiff. Um, Shavkat's record is 17 wins, zero losses and one KO, one, one draw with 14 KOs, which is really dangerous and really good for the lighter divisions. Um, normally those regional fighters, the Kazakhstan fighters, the Tajikistan, the Dagestan, the Russians, those regional of fighters, whether it's boxing or whether it's MMA, they're crazy and they've got unreal power and the way they train is just something different. So this fight's going to be a great fight. It's going to be a bomb burner and Joe is coming to, to take back what is rightfully his. He never lost his, his title. Um, who have I got in this fight? If you look on paper and if you look stylistically, a guy like Shafkat who's defended the super featherweight title, world title on several occasions, um, Joe Cordina's only won the belt and he never really defended it, but he's got a chip on his shoulder. He's got a grudge. He's coming back to look to win the IBF featherweight title. And I truly believe Joe Cordina will win this fight. He'll win this fight by knockout, uh, similar to Lara and Wood. Obviously, hometown and obviously it's not Nottingham, but it's hometown and he's a favourite and there could be a big upset and people could be overlooking Shafkat. And I wouldn't overlook him if I was you because 14 KOs, they don't come out of nowhere. He's a tough fight, he's a durable fighter, but I don't see this fight going the distance. And Joe Cordina's prepared hard and long and he's worked effortlessly or he's worked so, so hard to put himself back in his position and to rightfully earn what is his. And I truly believe come tomorrow night, he'll knock out Shafkat Rakimov in the later rounds, I'm going to go round eight knockout and he'll regain his title, jump on the ropes, celebrate in front of the Cardiff fans, the Cardiff faithful and become two-time IBF heavyweight champion of the world and win the IBF featherweight title. Thank you guys for tuning in to the video today. Be much appreciated if you could drop a, a, a like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you think for um, the fight tomorrow night. And I'll see you on the next one. Next one. Take care, guys.